Whilst I'm here in Texas, I'm going to be enjoying your good food. Yeah, can you imagine how rubbish everything's going to taste when we get back home? <laughs> it's going to be like... Hello? Hello? Hello, Kate? Wow. No, no, you can't just pick up a big one. Greetings! We are in Round Rock, and when you're in Round Rock, you have to have a Lone Star Bakery donut. We're here at Round Rock Donuts to get one of those Texas-style 18-inch diameter donuts. It's going to be a massive. We cannot wait for this. We've been talking to Colton, so we're going to get into Round Rock Donuts and see what it's all about. inside of Round Rock Donuts and it smells incredible. I mean, I'm so excited. That size of the Texas style donut is just massive. You cannot comprehend it. So we're going to be having the Texas donut and the... Definitely need to try one of those cinnamon rolls. Whether it's Texas size or not, I'm having a cinnamon roll because you know I like cinnamon rolls. Wow. wow. Look at is that. Is there a, a strawberry sprinkled in or a chocolate sprinkled? Do you want to try strawberry sprinkle? Do you want one? Good fun. Alana wants some? You got all shy. <laughs> And another thing that you might like. Oh, oh that's probably oh. more your bite size, isn't you it? Like Do you want one of those? Do you want to try one? Should we try one? Yeah. I'm gonna go get you a couple things to try, okay? Oh, oh, thank, thank, you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Wow. Say thank you, Colton. Hey, I got you both. I got you the sprinkled donut and the donut. Oh. oh say thank say you. Thank you thank you. You're gonna, gonna have some? Try. Elena, try? Might be a bit sh Should mummy get you a bit? Yeah, yeah mummy get you some? Is that okay if I... And anything that y'all want. Aww. We got you guys, but uh, oh, thank there's you. something for her to snack on for the time being. Thank you very much. Thank you. What are you going to try first? Oh. Oh, straight it. Oh. oh, she's going to go first. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> What's that face? Ooh. Try that. Hey, thank you. You can have a bite. Oh, looks nice, doesn't it? Is Alana going to have some? Go on then. Eat it. Try a bit. Oh, look how wow. fresh that is. <gasps> Straight in. What's the verdict? Mm. Nice. Mm. <laughs> Shall I put the big bit in here? Put it in there? Oh no, the small bit. She <laughs> wants the big bit. <laughs> Nice. Oh, you got a winner. <laughs> She's got a colourful face. Look at Daddy. Look at your face. Mmm. Oh. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Do you want to try a little bit of this one? Oh, God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's, I love the donut hole. <laughs> Mm. I didn't know about the little holes until mm. recently, like because it seems to make sense, doesn't it, that people do the holes as, as well as the like ring donuts, but they're not a thing as much back in the UK. Really? They're not, well, and over here, it's almost like a side of fries. It's like everybody gets like a box of donuts and they're like, oh, we can oh, get yeah. donut holes with it, you know, so. Uh, makes perfect sense. And they're good. And so we, we save all the donut holes out of the donuts, but like they sell a lot and we have a, a cutter back there that just makes little Oh, really? Basically, so that's cool. Oh, that's cool. Well, I think you liked that, didn't you? Suddenly quiet. <laughs> I think that's a good recommendation. Yeah. That would be tasty. Tell us a little bit more about Grand Rock Donuts. So we've been in business since 1926. We're very popular, I'd like to say across everywhere, but we're known for our special glazed donut. It's always hot. That's what the locals have made us known for. We've also been on TV for our big Texas sized donut. It's about this big around, about wow. that thick. And I can even show it to you really yes, fast. Yes, please, yeah. These are the uh, Texas sized donuts. Wow. People like to get them for birthdays or special occasions and we can write messages on them and wow. all sorts of stuff. So. They are massive. So am I right in saying they're 18 inches in diameter, is that right? Probably between 12 to 15. Yeah. I, I would have to guess, but. Wow. People say they're about the size of a steering wheel. 
<laughs> so there's something that we're definitely well known for. Yeah. And we are definitely going to be trying one of those, that's for sure. We have a challenge to see if people can eat one by themselves sometimes. So. Has anyone done it? Um, I've seen a few people do it. Have you? Wow. I'll give it a go, but... Yeah, it's yeah, a, it's it's a sharer gonna... for me. <laughs> They sit in these proofing containers for a while, and when they're ready to fry, there's kind of a small window of time that you have to take to fry them, but yeah, they have to be the right size. You don't want them to be too big or too small, so. Uh -huh. I just can't get over how good it smells, isn't it? <laughs> it smells amazing. We all take it for granted. Here's the deal. Yep. These donuts change your life. <laughs> it is you are for everything that if you ever have a bite of wine. This is gonna be a life-changing event, yeah? It is, it's life-changing. Yeah, I yeah. Promise. Sometimes the favorite pieces break off and just skim them, skim them. Oh, wow. It's one thing seeing it on TV, and then there's another thing seeing it in real life and smelling it. It's magical. It is a thing of beauty. Not yet. No, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're working on it. <laughs> so we'd like to order some of your infamous donuts. The famous glaze. Yes. So we would like to do Texas size. The Texas glaze. The, the Texas one. Okay. One of the small cinnamon rolls. Okay. And we're gonna try one of the kolaches, but is it the sausage one? Yes, ma'am. So we have the sausage, or we have the fruit kolache. I'm gonna go for the sausage, please. Okay. Just a small one. Okay. And would you like plain or with cheese? Cheese, okay. Please. And uh, that would be everything. So I understand you've worked here for quite a while. Yes, about 17 years. Wow, and mm -hmm. is it a good place to work? It is. They are just wonderful to their employees. That's why I've been here so long. I have a twin sister that works for the bakery. Oh, wow. And she works at the Cedar Park store. But we've been here many years. We just love the family that owns this bakery. Oh, good. They're just great people. So have you always been here and your sister's always been there? Or is your sister well, here as well? Um, the Cedar Park store is only about two years old. So she's just been there since that store opened, but otherwise she, we would be here together. Oh, and are you identical twins? We are. Oh, are you? So that must have been confusing. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, we know a lot of customers just by name, just because we've been here so long and, and we know a lot of our regulars. So most, they usually will know us apart. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. And in your opinion, Kelly, what sets aside Round Rock Donuts from any other donut? Well, it's just so unique. You know, people have tried to duplicate it and they can't, they haven't figured it out. You know, one of the reasons that it's so light is because we use fresh eggs in our dough that makes it very light, it gives it some of the color. A lot of places use powdered eggs in their dough because they don't have storage for that. Ah. So we use fresh eggs. Of course, it's all made with love. Good recipe for any American That's food, right. I'm understanding. Yes. We've had people from all over the world. I just love my job just because I get to meet people from everywhere and you know everybody everybody that works here just gets along very well. I've got to say everyone we've met so far has been very friendly and yeah. helpful which is mm -hmm. good. So the million dollar question yes what's your favorite donut? Well the glaze is the number one but the next my next favorite is the eclair. Oh, mm -hmm. is that with the cream fit? Yes, it has the vanilla custard in the middle with oh. chocolate on top. Some people prefer the white cream, some people prefer the vanilla custard fill. And we're not trying to hide the donut, you know, like a lot of places put lots of different toppings and whatnot, and you know, we're all about the donut. On the weekend, it's crazy busy. The, I heard. Oh, yes. Is it something like 500 dozen on a busy day? Um, probably more like a thousand. Yeah. A thousand dozen on a busy day. Yeah, oh, that's we, they go through a lot. And customer service is very important. That is number one on their list is customer service. Well, it does show. I can tell Thank everyone's you. been absolutely brilliant. Oh, and this place has been busy since we've come here. Thank you for that. You're Hello, very that's welcome. Brilliant. Wow. I got this top, this free top. I think it says out of this world. 
Ramrock Donuts is out of this world. If you take a look at what we've got. Unbelievable. Colton and all the guys, Kelly, Scott, Scott. Michelle, everyone have been so, so friendly, so generous. The amount of stuff we've got. Ah, it's epic. Yeah, it is epic. We're going to do this in two parts. So make sure you stick around if you haven't already subscribed to see part two because we've got so much stuff. We've got the big bad Texas boy, which you better stick around right to the end because we'll be doing that right at the end. We've got a dozen of the different donuts. You cannot appreciate how good this looks and how good this smells. This is incredible. I mean... <laughs> I don't even know where we should start. I don't know what's what. I reckon we should try... Oh, that is super soft. Oh, that... what? what? Should we try a glazed one first? Well, you've got some that you've already opened. Shall I get you one of these little ones? This is something else. I wish you could smell how good this is, but... Amazing. Alana is eating one of the donut <laughs> insides at the moment that we were kindly given, so yes. she is enjoying that again. She's already had one. But let's go for an original glaze then, Mr H. That, I cannot get over. That's so soft. Are you going to pick it up? Yeah, but I, it's like... Like soft, soft. Like sometimes oh you get donuts. Oh my god, it's so light. Sometimes you get donuts and they're quite dense and hard and. <laughs> oh. mm, mm. I'm, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. The suspense is killing me. Oh my gosh, it is. <laughs> it's like, I don't know, just gooey goodness. Let's try it. Oh. That's something else, isn't it? That is something else. I have never, ever, ever tasted a donut that good. That is like something I've never tasted before. As us Brits would say, that's different gravy, that is. That I've never tasted a donut like that. Wow. Ever. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> I'm not even hungry, but wow. No, no, you can't just pick up a big one. The guys at Round Rock Donuts, they know what they are. They doing. know, yeah. Wow. I want to eat all of it, but there's so many here. We're going to have to do this video in two parts. Go on then, pick up the one you want. No, you've already had you've that already. one. It's <laughs> like the one with sprinkles <laughs> the on. The pink sprinkles. Okay, we have got some kolaches, because we are in Texas. And we went for the sausage and cheese, but we've also got the jalapeno and cheese. I'm not sure which one's yeah, which. Yeah, Scott said that's where it's at. It uh, is. Yep. Oh, it's still oh. nice and warm. Okay. This got to be the jalapeno cheese. <laughs> I'm not even hungry, but I'm just excited. Right, let's go for it. Good. Mm. Oh. Wow. Mm. Whoa. Mm. Okay, that is beautiful. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Whoa. Okay, do you want to try a bit this one? Not too hot, try a bit. That's where it's at. That. You want me to put Okay, I think we'll save this one. That is lovely. That's really good. I'm going to have another bite. Again, no one tell my doctor that I'm here eating this amazing stuff. Okay. We're not doing that, do kolaches. You'd think just donuts, but no. Kolaches and sausage ones, jalapeno cheese ones. So soft. The skin is amazing. Not just crack through the skin. Lovely burn. Cheese, sausage. The bread as well. They're like kolaches. So I don't know what you call the bread. The dough and the kolaches mm. are just, oh, amazing. Mm. I promised myself I was only going to take one bite because there's so much stuff. You can. I'll have another one. You're going right. to have some of this? That is amazing. Another bite? I would finish this off right now, but there's a cinnamon roll to try. <laughs> okay, I am officially excited. In here is the cinnamon roll, and if you know me, you know I like cinnamon rolls. But wait, that's not all. We have got one of the vanilla custard eclair donuts and one of the apple fritters. Wow! Oh. We have been really, really spoiled today. We have been spoiled. I will be on a massive diet when I go back to the UK, but whilst I'm here in Texas, I'm going to be enjoying your good food. Yeah, can you imagine how rubbish everyone's going to taste when we get back home? Any Brits visiting Round Rock in Texas or anyone around the world, you have 
to try out round rock donuts. Uh, these, this is different. I'm not just saying that, this is something else. Let's get into the... Yeah, stop talking, I want to eat. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. Oh, I just... Oh, oh. oh. Okay. Oh. I might fall out of love with Cinnabon after this, I reckon. Ready? Go. Oh. Right, bye. <laughs> Come back here. <laughs> this is so good. Mm. I'm going to say something. Okay. I'll let you take it. Right. Bye. Oh, man. <laughs> speechless. I am actually speechless by that one. When you bite into it, it kind of, it's not gooey, but it kind of is. It yeah. oozes a little, doesn't it? Like oozes goodness it in your mouth. oozes goodness. Well, it's supposed to be one bite, Mr. H today, but I'm two now. Also, the cinnamon is not giving me heartburn, which lately I've been getting a little bit of heartburn from too much cinnamon. I'm just going to go for another oh. bite myself. Oh. And you guys have this on your doorstep. I'm moving to Round Rock. Mm, this is something else. Yeah, this is so, so good. Yeah. If any of the people that work at Round Rock want to come and live with us and make us these daily, yeah. you can stay with us. Anytime, <laughs> anytime. I think you should open up a restaurant in the UK, in, Bri in Bristol. We're just in our kitchen and you can come live with us and cook for us because it's sold. Yeah, sold. <laughs> okay, so the moment you've all been waiting for, we wanted to end with this bad boy. And it is a bad boy. They say everything's bigger in Texas. I was like, hmm. Yeah, maybe, until I saw this and I'm like, yes. A donut the definitely. size of your head. <laughs> Bigger than my head. Well, we can measure. Yeah. <laughs> right, you hold the box. I'll take the goodies. Look at that. This is like world breaking size, world breaking. Guinness World taste. Record donut, this is. Yeah. So they said, would you like it glazed or chocolate covered? Or you can have it half and half. So, half and half. So Colton was telling me only a few people have managed to do it, but someone has actually eaten all of this at once. Her name was Mrs. H. <laughs> right, right. Ready? Ready? Go. Okay. Oh. 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 What? Okay. Spin that round. I want the other side too. Oh, that's so nice. I, I, I'm, well, I am speechless. Right, let's go again. Ready? This is Lady in the Tramp of Donuts. <laughs> <laughs> Ready, girl. Oh, mmm. Okay. Mm. I love Grand Rock Donuts. So, 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 so good. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm speechless. It's all around your face as well, and probably mine. Mm. I'm speechless, genuinely, I am not just saying that. I, I just like... Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. oh. Elena, do you want some donut? <gasps> have a bite. Look at the size of that compared to baby H. Look, daddy have some. Oh. Mm. So you can see just how big this is. It is massive. Make sure you stick around for part two. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to subscribe to be notified every time we take a bite out of Texas. Mm. Um.